Hello guys, I'm CC here, but I'm another TF2 video, and today we are back talking about the Pyro update and general thoughts on the Pyro update and when it's going to be coming out and what is going to be in it. Although we kind of know 50 50 what will be going in this update. So, the first thing I thought I'd do is actually read what it said had happened in the Meat vs. Match update page thing by Valve. So it says, one lucky class is going to get full-fledged class pack in a future update. New weapons, new balancing, new achievements. It could be heavy or it could be pyro, but it's not going to be both. So, what do we know from this? Okay, so we know they, you know, they're going to be balancing weapons for the class. Going to add new weapons, which you kind of have to. You got to balance the previous weapon before you can, you know, add new ones. So hopefully that will mean the dreaded flaming volcano fragment thing will finally get sorted out um, and uh, new achievements which are always good especially considering I've uh, completed almost all of them so I posted on reddit a couple of days ago and if you want to see the reddit it's in the description below but the, um, the when do people think this update is going to come out now a lot of people said near Smithmas time or summer next year and I sat there in disbelief, like, there's no way it can come out in summer next year. But, you know, there's, the chance is still there. I like to think of it as, okay, so Valve, they wanted us to vote. They, they already had the concept, they knew what they wanted to do with this update. You know, we vote and then they do this. It's a bit weird, I'm not going to lie. So, I'd like to think they've got at least some of the components made. Because we know that the update is going to come to heavy as well. It's just going to be over time. It'll, you know, maybe that'll be in summer if it comes out in, if the pyro one comes out in uh, Christmas. So I'm thinking it'll come out rather really, really, really late November, early December or Christmas. I do think we'll get it in 2016. Well, I like to think that we'll get it in 2016 because uh, they postponed an entire uh, Scream Scream Fortress event. Like there's no way they'd have postponed it if this is going to be a long, long project. Like, if that's the case, that means, say, okay, the Pyro update is estimated to come out in, in summer next year. That means they're going to forfeit doing Screen Fortress this year, which I'm already pretty pissed off about. Smithmas this year, and Smithmas last year was dire. That, that was my least favourite update ever. It was so lazy, it was just atrocious. They'd be skipping the... The uh, the birthday of TF2, the anniversary, which never do anything big for, but they at least like make you aware that it's the birthday and all that lot. And they'd be missing the summer, so no summer crates. And between then, you've got all the crates that they usually release at that point throughout the year. So they're gonna miss about three or four updates just to work on this long-term one. I'd rather just not get it if that's the case. But loads of people believe that's that's when it's going to come out. I, I I personally agree with everyone who commented on the post and said, yeah, I think it'll come out at Christmas time. Just to play, you know, your bet safe. I think it'll come out at Christmas time. I do hope they release some new um new weaponry skins. That's kind of that's my thing. I have all of them. There's all of the weaponry skins are in my backpack in strange quality. So I'd like to see some new ones added. And um and yeah, I just I think. I think everyone's got really low expectations for this update, so so for example the uh, flame particle effect. For those of you that don't know, the distance that the flames travel to ignite a player and burn them varies on your Wi-Fi strength. And I know, it's it's a load of shit, it's, it's horrible. So if you got really good internet, say if I play on a US server, I have really really bad ping because uh, I'm in Britain. And that, uh, that means that my flame particles, I'm going to basically have to be hugging them. And I've had that before, I've basically had to hug players for them to be ignited. But if I play on, say, a Luxembourg server, I don't, I've, sorry, I have no idea what the fuck Luxembourg is, I swear it's Germany. Um, I usually have really, really good ping, about 30, 40, something like that. And I can get a fair old medium distance between players, but then maybe, say, you're on a server... <laughs> Fuck it, maybe you got a server down the road from you that you're connected to for some bizarre reason. And you got four ping. You could probably like ignite someone from the other end of the map. Now it's not it's not that bad, but I'm not gonna lie, I've 
it's it's close to that. It's definitely um, Pyro is a game of who's got the best Wi-Fi kind of thing. So um, so obviously I'd like to imagine they fix that as well as everyone else is hoping that they fix that. New achievements will be cool. The new balancing. Pyro's got a lot of shit weapons. Not gonna lie, the degreaser they nerfed it. Oops, sorry. Nerfed it horribly. Um, I'd like to see a new strange mall added to the game. Not gonna lie, seeing that strange would be cool. Maybe nerfing the back burner a bit. I do hate that weapon. Phlogistonator. I like the phlogistonator the way it is. I'm pretty sure that that don't need touching. Sharpened volcano fragment needs something doing with it. And uh, apart from that, it's, it's not really anything else. All the all the other weapons for him are reskins. Him or her, whatever the fuck it is. Or maybe they'll even release that. You know, maybe they'll release a comic revealing the gender of the pyro. But I'd imagine not. That'd be quite, quite a rare thing. But yeah, that's just my thoughts on the pyro updates. You um, comment what you think about it. I reckon it'll be coming out Christmas time. Definitely, uh, definitely. If it's past Christmas, I'm not interested. And by that point, I've just fucking lost all hope for Valve. So um, please rate, comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one. Adios.